Hey, what's up, YouTube? Today we're going to talk about spark plugs, exhaust manifolds, and motor mounts. It's a rainy day, but we're going to get some stuff done anyway. So we, we talked about spark plugs on a previous video and I didn't really go over much at all about checking out these plugs uh, as another confirmation of how well the engine was running. Uh, if you get kind of close here to the, uh, the electrodes and the ground straps you can see got a little whiteness to them. Um, that's kind of what you would expect from like an OEM completely stock tune on a vehicle. Uh, they typically focus on well, primarily uh, emissions and uh, fuel economy. So, you know, you could tell it's a little on the looks a little on the lean side by the color of the plugs, but but it's fine for OEM. And then you can see this plug here. We talked about oil leaking past the seals between the valve covers and then the upper cam towers and. Uh, you see that little bit of oil that was, you know, getting down there on the threads. So that's what, you know, people start to panic when they see that. But yeah, let's get to it. All right, these exhaust manifold bolts here, uh, we've been soaking them. Like, yeah, I've been soaking them every other day for about a week with uh, this penetrant, this PV blaster. Um, like I say, uh, they're notorious for breaking. It's like literally a dice roll, um, whether you can get them off or not without breaking them. So we're going to see what happens if we get lucky or not. I've gotten lucky a couple times, but it's not often. And you can you can take that exhaust, or the, I'm sorry, the uh, motor mounts off without pulling the manifolds. Okay, so far so good. Okay, so far so good again. Okay. Okay, alright. Looking good. Need my luck if I uh, spin them off with a drill and, you know, that's all she wrote. <laughs> Snap one or two. some of these turbo applications uh, some of them have like bolt up kits to these exhaust or these uh, factory headers and uh, leaving these on there is a, you know a heck of a lot better than having to spend money on those you know DI wraps and planes and things like that Actually, I mean, these are, you know, fairly well-made headers uh, for a naturally aspirated V6. So we'll keep all that together. Um, so I want to say the 2014 Plus allegedly flow a little better. Like nice size exhaust ports too, from, uh, you know, for factory. This is 14. Block to go to the, to the machine shop to get uh, uh, the deck surfaced and uh, uh, cylinders board. So get it all out of the way. Keep it all together. Keep the bolts in there. It's fine. Yeah, we'll uh, we'll move on to the fuel rail. All right. So 
I'll move on to the fuel rails. Uh, I'm working from the front side of the engine here, so you know, of course, this is a one, two, three, four, five, six. bolts together with it also. inside there so yeah we'll uh, set this to the side